I would be honored to share this proclamation. Before I begin, uh, this is the 32nd year of Rockville Science Day. It's recognized every year by the Mayor and Council. Um, for all who want to attend, and I would strongly encourage, I have brought my kids since they were uh, very, very little till now. Um, it's going to be a fantastic, fun, multi-family um, and also multi-age, multi multi-dimensional opportunity to really learn about science and to put it in action. It'll occur on April 23rd from noon to 5 p.m. at the Rockville campus of Montgomery College, and it is free. Opening ceremonies will be in front of the Physical Education Building at 1 p.m. And the Rockville Science Center is an interactive space for all ages. I see some of the folks are here, and I welcome them to join. As soon as I'll finish reading, I'll uh, deliver the proclamation physically, but you're welcome to come inside. Um, Rockville Science Center is also, if you, want, if you can't wait till the 23rd, and if you want to go after, uh, they have a wonderful space in town center. Um, they are now a 501c3, and they offer all kinds of classes from rocketry, first Lego, STEM Scouts, lecture series. They even had a photography class uh, that I saw posted on the window there. So check it out for all ages. Um, and they also have uh, planetarium exhibits. With that, I will read the proclamation. Whereas on April 22, 1990, the Rockville Science Center held its first Rockville Science Day, and has continued Science Day as an annual event in the city of Rockville. Whereas this marks the 32nd anniversary of Rockville Science Day, and whereas Rockville Science Day is a local family-oriented event designed to equate youth with the world of science and to help both children and grown-ups alike understand how science is used in our lives. And whereas science lies at the heart of technological progress, space exploration, human and ecological health, and environmental concerns, and Science Day provides informative and entertaining exhibits about everything from environmental science to nature to reptiles, birds, space exploration, biotechnology, robotics, and rockets. And whereas on April 23rd, 2023, Rockville Science Center will present its 32nd annual Rockville Science Day and have activities for kids of all ages. Now therefore, the Mayor and Council of Rockville, Maryland, do hereby proclaim April 23rd as Rockville Science Day in Rockville and urge all members in our community and beyond to participate in this opportunity to connect with science and the real world. I move the proclamation. All those in favor, Council Member Prashela, thank you. I'll second. Moved and seconded. All those in favor, please raise your hand. It is unanimous. Thank you. Welcome, Rockville Science Center people. Mr. Ekman, and I know Howard Lichtman was on the, the list, so if you all want to come in real quickly, that'd be fine. Yeah, that's great. You had a great grand opening, so that was wonderful. Yeah. Thank you for the uh, proclamation, and I hope to see everyone there. We're expecting a, a sunny day. We're going to have nice weather. We have a lot of exhibitors. I've been combing through the exhibitors for a while, and uh, we have a lot of really good exhibits from ones that we've had in the past and some that we have a lot of new ones. We'll be all over the campus for those that uh, haven't ever been there before. We are in many different buildings in the, on the campus, and we have exhibitors. We have um, almost 100 exhibitors, and we're expecting about 2,500 people. So it's going to be a, a, a beautiful day, and it's going to have a, a lot of things. We start at noon, if it, if it wasn't already announced. We start at noon, and we have a, a ceremony at 1, 1 p.m. out in front of the uh, gym, and uh, we're hoping to see members of the council and the mayor there at that time, and uh, we, will, uh, uh, we will go to 5 o'clock. We have a rocket launch at 4 o'clock, which is always a big deal 
and a lot of other things going on there. We have uh, food for sale, and of course it's free parking. If it hadn't already been announced, it's free parking, and the event itself is free also. And we're very thankful for the college for providing an awful lot of support for this, and of course for the city for providing support too. So thank you. Well, congratulations, and thank you all. It's always a wonderful day, as Councilmember Ashton said. It is. Thank you very much. Thanks again. Yeah.